Hey, what's up folks? It's Rojo, and welcome back to Let's Play Hammerwatch. So, when we last left off, we were, uh, I believe, just exploring, uh, or actually almost finished with Floor 5. And, uh, we were probably headed back over to, uh, Floor 6, uh, pending anything else that comes up down here. I know that there was, yeah, there's this one area to the west, um, but I don't know that we can get there. Yeah, like, there's a staircase, if you see in sort of the left-hand side of the screen there on the map. Um, I guess I should bring that back up. Yeah, right over there now, it's in the, the northwest, but yeah, I think, uh... I think we'll get there probably through a different route, so let's go back to floor six. I think we've explored all of this floor, pretty sure. But yeah, we can, uh, jump in here, we have a gold key, let's see what we can get. Steel 2 increases the chance from 15 to 30 percent. Now eventually, this is not going to be... A worthwhile investment I feel like um, but 30% uh, chance for one coin but it's gonna cost us uh, 436 uh, coins that we already have now this is interesting the thief shoots a grapple chain which he uses to move forward quickly enemies uh, move through get stunned for one second costs zero coins to use uh, why would it cost any coins to use? This, like, armor, I don't know if we really need the armor. I will buy the grapple chain, though, uh, because it sounds interesting. And, uh, we can get a chain length upgrade. I guess we will buy steel, too. Um, it may not be a worthwhile investment for us, but nonetheless. Uh, so we have one more of these, uh, these seals that we have to unlock additionally well we already have a potion and we don't need an extra life right now so we don't need to worry about that we can get move speed and uh, we can get our our mana pool and health pools upgraded if we want to uh, let's see what we have over here though speed penalty 2 fan of knives 1 this one might might be worthwhile. We can get up to like 20% attack speed, assuming I can push the button fast enough to uh, make that work. But I think maybe knife fan damage might be better. Uh, I think we're going to save our gold for now. Let's see, wh where's our chain at? Yeah, there it is. That's pretty cool, I like that. How do we get into... This room back here, I wonder. Is there a secret door here? No, there's no secret door there. Ah, I see. There's going to be a staircase that'll lead us uh, right over there. So that's fine. Let's, um... Let's go this way. I wonder what happens if we... Whoops, that was the wrong, uh, wrong ability. Looks like we can't quite, uh... Reach the wall. Let's try it now. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. Let's uh, finish our exploration. I think we're going to have a lot easier time now that we have uh, the proper damage and such. But first, we actually have to figure out where we were going in the first place. Probably up here. We'd love to get that, uh, that extra life in there. But how do we get in there? One must wonder. There's no uh, secret doors here. No secret doors here. Doesn't look like we're going to get in this way. This wall is not even attached, I don't think. So maybe... Ah. Maybe we go around through here? No? Well, okay, that's fine. I guess we'll just have to keep looking. Ah, okay, so there is a fair bit of this uh, floor left. Got a uh, skeleton pit here that I guess I declined to... Uh, to uh, deal with out of safety concerns. Ah, oh, the damage is so good. So good. These, uh, these skeleton archers really aren't too much of a threat because uh, they don't hit very hard. Unlike a lot of the melee enemies which just like wallop you and uh, you feel that real, real quick. And those turrets, those turrets are the worst. 
But we do have quite a lot of damage, and we have a, uh, a method to uh, sort of move more quickly towards things like that. We did take a hit there from one skeleton, but uh, all in all, uh, I think we're, we're going to have maybe an easier time with the turrets most, most of the time. Especially if we uh, are able to like do something like this and get a combo going. Oh, okay, well I didn't quite make it through there. Oh, oh, we got hit by two, uh, two things. Tell you what, let's, uh, <laughs> let's, uh, reload. I didn't think, I, I assumed you would, uh, I guess I should know this by now, but I was uh, sort of assuming you would get a period of invincibility when you get hit, uh, instead of getting, uh, hit by two projectiles at once. And, uh, I was wrong about that. Let's, let's put it that way. So, that's okay. No big deal. Let's get through this uh, as quickly as we can. And then, uh... We'll handle that situation perhaps a little bit more wisely next time. Yeah, we gotta be careful. Those, those turrets are, are real, real, real nasty. Now, I do wonder if the defense upgrade, uh... Like it says, increases damage reduction from 1 to 2. Does that mean we actually reduce 1 damage every time we get hit? Or does it mean that, uh, you know, there are different levels of, of damage reduction and, you know, like maybe our damage reduction 1 gives us 3 damage resistance, damage reduction 2 maybe gives us 5 damage resistance, if you, if you understand what I'm saying. So, something, something to uh, consider. Uh, oh, careful of that bomb. So, you know, because right now it seems, ow, it seems like the, uh, the, the defense upgrade, at least for the thief, I don't know if it's different for other characters, is, uh, not really a great deal. Um, but, you know, we'll, we'll see how it shakes out. We may, we will probably end up getting some of the defensive upgrades eventually, even though I strongly, uh, would prefer for this to be a, uh, sort of more offensively themed, uh, playthrough, especially since, uh, Killing enemies slowly is basically a death sentence, um, and I suspect that it doesn't really matter what your defense is at that point. Oh, oh, that's interesting. We just uh, <laughs> we can uh, just straight up run into people. I wonder if we can if we use this on the turret if it will uh, if it will stun the turret, or maybe turrets are unstunnable. Guess we'll find out before too long here, won't we? Got that generator, that's very good. We can safely stand down here, um, away from the turret, so that's also very good. Hey, there's an apple down there, we don't need it right now. Would love to use this combo on that turret. We did hit it a couple times, so that's a, uh, that's a definite plus. But, uh, whoops, there we go. Helps if you uh, face the right way when swinging at your enemies, I'm told. Have it on uh, very good authority. Okay, that'll go through, and then... Okay, I guess we better back off. We don't want to, uh... Take the damage for free. I will try to grapple to that thing, though. Um... As soon as we kill these guys. There we go. Alright. I'm gonna wait for that to go one more time. And now I'm gonna come up here. I want to deal with these, uh... Yeah, these things. Oop, careful. Oh, I guess they can't reach anyway, so that's good. Good news indeed. Okay, 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 and you are dead. Yeah, the archers are super duper easy to deal with, uh, thankfully. And once we have this combo going, we're kind of unkillable by uh, the archers as well. Oop, these, this is a big guy. We definitely don't want him to be hasted. I wonder if these banners stack up. Um, the, uh, you know, the attack speed and movement speed and all that good stuff. Oh, no, 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 okay. Thank goodness. It's too bad we can't get a combo off crates. That would be, uh, pretty rad, actually. Could certainly make our lives a little bit easier. Okay. Uh, we do want to get that coin. Let's, uh, let's see here. I see, okay. No sweat. All right. Ah, we have a checkpoint here. Cool. So we'll use this checkpoint, and uh, we'll, let's try out our um, our theory about whether or not we can grapple to this turret successfully and stun it. 
It's really what we're interested in. No, it doesn't look like we can stun it. Uh, but we can grapple to it, thankfully. So that's uh, something we'll keep in mind. We'll try to use that to our advantage in the future. Uh, because closing on the turrets is... You know, it's a, it takes a lot of time away from the time that we could be swinging at the turrets. So that's... Um, that could give us a really good advantage in a, in a tight spot. Okay, so I think we've successfully cleared out uh, this little area here. I guess, actually, you know what? I should be doing a better job looking for secret doors uh, just because you never know what you might find in there. In particular, we would love to have some more extra lives because, uh, as you've seen, my play in this game is sometimes a little sloppy, sometimes extremely sloppy, sometimes it's uh, pretty good, but, you know. There we go. Give me, give me that combo. Thank you very much. Now, where is that other turret? There it is. There we go. We hit it with one of those uh, combos. What I want to do, though, is uh, if I can get these guys down here and then uh, get another combo going, I'm going to run right up there. Yeah, there we go. That's exactly how I wanted that to go. One of the few examples of excellent play. Okay. Yeah, we, uh, we're quite powerful now, and actually, you know, we're getting coins quite a lot faster than we were before. I mean, twice as fast, to be, uh, precise, but, uh, it's nice to see, even if it's not a lot of money, which I suspect that it's probably not, but you never know. It may, uh, it may end up adding up to, like, one, one or two more extra upgrades for us, so we'll see how it shakes out. I'd love to have that vendor coin shit. Well, that's fine. We got an orange right there. Oh, come on. Really? Well, I mean, I guess that's where it would go. Uh, do we want that orange? We don't want that orange right now. Let's instead, uh... What is... Is that... No, nope. all right. Thought I saw a secret door. I was mistaken. Okay. I don't see any uh, secret doors here, but it looks like... Yeah, we can, we can go back up uh, to the north here a bit. Oh. It's an archer in this uh, hallway. Not anymore, though. Oh, well, there's an archer at the end of the hallway instead now. That's fine. As long as we keep the combo going, we're just gonna get, we're gonna be able to heal through. Whoa! Anything that the uh, pretty much anything that the uh, archers can throw at us, anyway. Now the question is, can we walk past? Ooh, yeah. I was gonna say, can we walk past this trap? And uh, I think the answer is no. No, we cannot. We can, however, take all this money. Now, checking for secret doors, usually... Like, if it's gonna be behind one of these banners, it was like a little set of eyes. Uh, like in the other floors. Man, those side traps are really difficult to see. But I think we can do this if we go... Oh, it's just too short. There we go. There are more to go. Yeah, no shit. Probably quite a few, I would uh, suspect. Nope. And away we go. Do this one. Just walk right across. As long as we, you know, don't dilly dally, I think we'll be okay. Oh. Well, <laughs> that middle one got me. That's okay. I didn't quite see what the loot was, but there's also the trap there, which uh, is not quite so pleasant. Let's see, yes, we think we just go right back over here. It's a lot of treasure. Hey, and there's a button as well. This thing's hit for 70 freaking damage, though. I don't know, hmm. I think, ah, there we go. Yeah, we'll let the traps deal with them. That sounds way better. And we can just go like that. And uh, these guys I'm not even remotely worried about because they're just regular skeletons. Okay, so that's one switch. Need to be careful not to uh, anger uh, <laughs> the traps too much here. And uh, yeah, they're gonna cut through those skeletons for us uh, for free. Can't, compl can't complain about that. The grizzly combination. Uh, do we we're not going to get that one copper piece. That's just not gonna happen, <laughs> honestly. Doesn't look like there's any secrets here though. Um, what about... Ah, there's a chest that I actually missed. Almost ran right into that trap. 
a couple chests that I missed. I see. It's a uh, little bit of a secret passage that we created there. That's fine. Wonder if that opened up this area or was this already open? Hard to say. Take this. Uh, run away. Okay, we made it. I think we still have enough. Yeah, we definitely have enough uh, magic to do another grappling hook. So we'll wait for this. Oh, we. Oh, that's so bad. That's so bad. I I was thinking that we would uh, that we would grapple over and uh, and go straight to the thing, but we got stuck on the edge of the wall. There's nothing to grapple to there, of course, um, but the edge of the wall, and uh, then we died. So that kind of sucks. It's okay though. We'll uh. We'll get through this, one way or the other. <laughs> as long as we, uh, yeah, don't eat one of these, everything will, will be all right, I think. Oh, we did eat one though. We're, we're hitting it, yeah, with the uh, the combo though, so that's good. Just gonna run over here and grab that apple right there. I wonder how we get that that gem. I'm assuming we probably can't grapple to the gem based on yeah how that went last time oh that's interesting though there must be a secret button somewhere that we need to push to uh, to be able to get to the the gem there okay that was pretty good might have been able to kill it but it's such a risky play because uh, our HP is so low it'll two shot us or well very nearly two shot us this thing has so many hit points Wonder if it like regenerates or something if we don't uh, do enough damage to it in uh, you know a short a short amount of time. It's okay though. We will grab uh, yeah we'll grab this bronze key, come down here and uh, make sure we activate all the proper things and uh, we'll get this treasure. And I think I may uh, go back and save over at that. Uh, oh yeah, there's another there's an extra life there. How do we get that, though? Don't appreciate you shooting me, Skeleton. It seems a little unfair. How do you like it? Oh, <laughs> I was intending to shoot knives at him, but that was way funnier. Um, let's see, where... Where would this thing come out, I wonder? Where would be the button, even, for us to... Uh, to get it to teleport? No idea. There is uh, something else in the southwest there, but let's uh, make sure we come back here and clean up the, the area that we sort of were at before, uh, before we go back over there. There we go, we'll just combo our way right through here again. No problem. Okay. We definitely don't really need to worry about any of these guys. I'm annoyed that that skeleton is still alive. There we go, we got him. Okay, let's try to do this without dying this time. What we're going to do is we're going to go like so. And then we'll come over here and we'll go like so, like so. Uh, uh. We can safely come over here and grab these as well. Okay, and we'll go like so. And then what we're going to do is go boom, boom. There we go. That's much better. And then if we just do this... They should follow us and get uh, pretty much lit up by the uh, the traps there. Very nice. That went much better than last time. And I think if we just go... Nope. <laughs> We're not fast enough, I guess. Um, I was pretty sure that we'd be able to make it across there. You know what, though? I'm going to just save anyway. Because I don't want to have to do that again. Oop, wrong way there. Okay. So I think we can come down this way now instead of going like through the trap. Yeah, much better. Let's come over here, do that. And then uh, we'll come down and around. And we'll get the other one. 
Ah, well, we got a one-up back this time. That's actually really nice. And then I think that opens up, yeah, a passage over here. Or maybe... I think this passage was already open, but... It uh, gave us some treasure nonetheless, which is much appreciated. Almost ran past that. Uh, I don't see anything else up there, so... Let's mosey back down here. Now that we've got their attention, <laughs> we should be able to take these guys out uh, without having to worry too much about the um, the trap. Okay, how are we going to do this? There's no way, like no way, that we can, uh, that we're going to be able to get to that thing. Yeah, there we go. All right, that's a little bit better. Maybe if we get a combo here. Okay. Nope. And then, uh, nope. Nope. Okay. We can use the, uh, the thing to get to the, the, uh, turret from this angle. And then basically do that. And that might work. Just run away. And then come back in. Yeah, I'm liking this grappling hook quite a bit, actually. Hey, we got a uh, damage upgrade from uh, destroying that thing. That's actually pretty cool. Was not expecting that. There's a secret door, no doubt. This is a, a potion vendor, by the looks of it. What have you for me? Hmm, nothing really that we need. We do still have that, uh, whoop. We do still have a, uh, you know, just a straight up regular health potion at our disposal as well. So we'll be sure to use that, uh, or at least try to remember to use that. I'd like to be able to save in the not- Hey, there you go, asking you shall receive. I was gonna say, I'd like to be able to save in the not too distant future, and uh, there we go. Okay, well, I think we'll uh, go ahead and call uh, this one an episode. But uh, when we come back, we'll, we'll definitely continue our explorations on floor six here. And uh, see if we can get access to some of those items to the west as well, because uh, there's some good stuff over there. But until next time, my name has been Rojo, and thanks for watching.